Folks in Guilford being told to keep an eye out after a string of car thefts and break-ins. News 8's Jackie Slater has a warning now from police. Quiet streets with houses close together and lots of cars sitting in driveways. Guilford police say Mulberry Point is the latest neighborhood to get hit by thieves, with several car break-ins reported early this morning. We've had a series of car break-ins over the last couple of months as a number of other communities along the shoreline and throughout the state have, uh, have also uh, had the same type of crimes occurring. In addition to Mulberry Point, cars were also targeted on River Street last night. Deputy Chief Butch Hyatt says the thieves are working in groups, often hitting dozens of cars at a time. These are, again, young adults or youths, juveniles that are committing these crimes. Uh, typically, they come into a neighborhood stealing not only property from in the vehicles, but many times people leave their keys in the vehicles and they're stealing cars. Police say it's not just personal property that they're worried about. The way that these thieves operate, they're also concerned for public safety. Hyatt says when caught in the act, many of the thieves will drive off recklessly, putting lives in danger. When it's time to flee, it's not their car they're driving, so they don't care about damaging that vehicle, damaging police vehicles, damaging the uh, uh, property of uh, private citizens. Today, a stern warning to the crooks. Police are watching. And now so are the people who live here. We've uh, made a couple of arrests in the past of groups that have come into town. Uh, we had one incident where a police officer interrupted him on his patrol. We were able to make an arrest of a number of uh, people in that incident. Officers reminding everyone to lock your car doors, keep outdoor lights on, and call the cops if you see anything suspicious. Reporting in Guilford, Jackie Slater, News 8.